Hello again and welcome to the latest episode in the Hearthstone series. Today I've got another exciting episode for you. Today I'm playing another game with my Warlock. So in today's video, um, I'm going to be playing, seeing how it goes. Uh, if you want to add me up, add me up on Bear Meals, hashtag 2120. Um, please like, share and subscribe the video. As always, feel free to drop a comment, but please, please, please subscribe. So in today's video, I'll be playing Gul'dan Warlock against Medivh Mage. So the actual player I'm playing against is Duzanek or Duzanek, I'm not sure. But I've got two two costs and one five costs. So I'm probably going to get rid of the five cost, Despicable Dreadlord. I'm going to keep Gnome Feratu, which is an epic, and Tainted Zealot, which is a common. So hopefully I'll get a one cost here. Nope. I, don't, I think there's only two one costs in my whole entire deck. Possessed Villager and the Mistress of Mixtures. So maybe I might have to get out that Cold Light Oracle for one for another one cost. That would be ideal. Um, so I think this game I'm just going to have to, you know, run it along, see how it goes. Because the Mage is a very, very powerful um, I know I spoke about the Warlock not being human, um, pretty much invincible in Hearthstone. I, I don't know if you've seen the uh, the Hearthstone movies or the World of Warcraft movies. I've never played World of Warcraft, but I've watched the movie and the movie was amazing. Um, if you really like the, the game, I urge you to see the movie. I really like these kind of movies, you know, like kind of like Lord of the Rings-esque. There's orcs. There's like elves, dwarves, demons. Yeah, I really like the movie. Um, but yeah, so as you can see, he's gone in for a kind of defensive kind of uh, taunts and secrets kind of deck. Um, I kind of imagine he's got a lot of spells as well because obviously he's a mage. So I'm just going to try and take it easy, kind of outplay him. Because I like Mage as well, so I know what kind of de kind of cards Mage will have. Anyway, for my next turn, I think I'm going to go Tainted Zealot and the Hero Power. Which is the two-cost circle right next to the Hero. In case you didn't know. So for some reason, he's actually played a one-cost secret. So I'm not sure why that is, but... I'll attack anyway, because I have no other option. And now I have another Tainted Zealot. So even if I miss this one, I'll always have another one. Unless of course I miss that one too. Oh, there we go. The first big spell is out. Nemferatu, my first card out seems to have survived and out comes another tar creeper i feel like i'm kind of going at this like a kind of commentator you know like kind of like oh this happens like boxing you know which is awesome i think i actually like that but obviously if you don't like it or if you like it let me know in the comment section because i'm just trying to try new things you know i'm not getting bored i love it i'm loving a youtube but i do need to expand a little bit If you're watching this video and you would like to get involved in any way, my email is at the bottom of the video. Also, feel free to get in contact via a comment. Oh, Cabal Trafficker is out. I didn't really get a good minion, but that's fine. He doesn't need to know that. What is he going to do? Another secret. So now he's got two secrets. I think one of them's to do with, um, what's it called? Whenever I play a spell. So 
but RIP to Gnome Ferratu there. Now I just have to get out and replace with this big old board Dreadlord. No, I could have avoided that by playing Void Walker first. I should have known. That was a very easy mistake. So not only have I allowed his minion to survive and kill one of my favorite minions in this deck, but now I lost an extra minion. Include like, and that doesn't even include all the other minions that I just lost. But anyway, out comes Sylvanas Windrunner to kind of fix things, and hopefully, she does. She does look like the um, the rogue, actually. Oh no, that's Jaina. Jaina. Oh no, that's the mage. Hmm, that's very strange. But anyway, so I'm, I'm obviously I'm just gonna let that live. I, n I never really kill these ones. But what I will do, actually, no, I can't really let it live, can I? Um, ink. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Carnivorous thing. This is the the dream combination, ladies and gentlemen. But obviously without Baron Rivendell, that would be the ultimate dream combination. And I'm sure that you know more than me about that combination anyway. But 15 to 20. I have six cards. They have four. I have four minions. They have none. Well, it looks like I'll be getting rid of Carnivorous Ooze this turn, getting back two Sylvanas Windrunners, or I can get rid of the two to attack minions and get a one cost one attack minion. Either way, my enemy is realizing that it's all over now, I, as you can tell by these words coming up on the screen and the fact that the time is running out. So, for my next trick, I might let him live as a goodwill gesture. 4 plus 2 plus 2 plus 1 plus 4. Okay, maybe not plus that extra 4. So, 4 plus 2 plus 2 plus 1, that's 8. So I need to do 7 more damage to win the game. And it's over this turn. Unless, of course, he does something. Which he can. Because it's half stone. But it's unlikely. Even though it's four cards versus four cards. But sometimes, you know, it's about having those minions. It's about having those cards already out. You know? So I might have one card in my hand and have seven minions on the field. And he might have 10 cards in his hand. You know? Sometimes that's uh, all it's about. But thank you very much for watching today's video. I hope you've learned something new about the game. I certainly have. Um, and that doesn't include the people leaving. It means that you win. But it does. But thank you once again. Please feel free to like, share and comment on the video. Uh, subscribe please 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 subscribe 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 as you can see you have the Fortnite video playlist on the left and the half stone playlist on the right 
in the middle you have a subscribe button so i'm hoping you subscribe to me please do if you haven't already and if you have please just tell your friends about it and share the video at the bottom you have a tailored video for yourself please enjoy and take care